What's up guys? Welcome back to the channel. Have your iPhone running the App Store like this. When you launch it, Sang cannot connect to App Store. No matter how many times you retried, it just stay in the same page. Trust me, by watching today's video, you can easily solve this problem because I've collected some tips that truly workable for this. Now let's jump right in. The first common tip that works for most people is to set data and time automatically, which is recommended by Apple. Go to General and Settings and find date and time. So if you want to make sure everything goes well, please turn on Set Automatically button. Then go back to App Store, try again. The second common tip people would try is to check the cellular settings. If you turned off the cellular settings for App Store before, it would cause this issue also. So in cellular settings, scroll down to find App Store and make sure the button is toggled on. The third tip is to sign out your Apple ID for App Store, sign in again. Many people only know how to sign out in App Store but actually, you can do this in settings as well. Just tap your account and find media and purchases. Then tap on it and tap on sign out button for App Store. When it's done, tap again to sign in. Sometimes, reboot your iPhone could be also a good choice. You can just shut down your iPhone by pressing the volume down and side button. Or you can just simply force restart it by press and release volume up and down and press and hold the side button till it reboots automatically. It won't guarantee a 100% success, but still worth to try. Wi-Fi connection error could also lead to this problem. You can go to settings and check out the Wi-Fi you're using is available or not. Turn it off and then turn on again. Or you can just simply go to reset in general and then reset network settings. Another tried and tested tip is to check for an iOS update and install it. In some cases, problems arise from software quirks. So getting rid of your current iOS version and downloading its replacement is often a good way of resolving issues. If right now you're running the latest iOS system, you can consider using Reiboot to refreshing the system without any data loss. You can find the download link in description below. Then connect iPhone to computer. Then click start with the standard repair mode, which won't cause any data loss on your iPhone but refresh your iPhone system in minutes. Super easy and worth trying. Just go to Tenorshare.com and you can get it downloaded. When your iPhone is refreshed, the problem may be solved. And this time, you can using App Store without any connection error. Congratulations! Okay, so that's all for today's video. If it helps, don't forget to give us a thumbs up. I'll be very grateful if you subscribe. Stay tuned for our next video.